All right, we're back now, and this is cause number CR21-28106, and uh, Ms. McDonald, have you had the time you needed to conference with your client? I have, Your Honor, um, and if I could put just a few things on the record. You may. Uh, uh, Mr. Catton, um, I just want to go over a couple of things to see if you and I are on the same page. Do you recall me coming out to the jail on Saturday, May the 18th? It was in the evening after seven o'clock. Yes. And um, th that was the first time you and I had met face to face. Is that right? Yes. Do you recall that I was I talked with you about your case and that I had the discovery with you or with me um, about the case? And and you had the opportunity to to look at it if you wanted to. I, I mean, I guess. Do, do you recall telling me um, that it, it, you really didn't need to see that? You just wanted me to try to get you a time served off. Yeah. I mean, obviously, because I've been in jail for three years. Okay. Not, so, not, prison, not prison, not penitentiary, jail, jail yes, in psych ward for three years. I don't care. I want to get out of here. I'm ready to get out of here. Over three years. Let me the f out of here. Sir. Your Honor, um, I, I, at this point, um, I, I have even in breakout. A PVC saw? Okay, Mr. Caton. Okay, Mr. Caton, I'm just going to go ahead and mute you. I can't hear two people at the same time, and we're trying to work through your hearing. So, Ms. McDonald, if you'll finish your statement, please. Your Honor, um, even in the, in the breakout session, um, I, I asked Mr. Catton a, a series of questions that similar to what will be asked in a competency hearing. He is able to understand that. He's able to talk to me. Although Mr. Catton, I, he's upset, clearly. Um, I, 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 I still don't have any concerns about competency based on his response to uh, my questions that I've asked him. However, um, I, at, at this point, um, the only thing I know to do with what he wanted me to ask if the court accepted no contest, please. And I've been informed that, that you do not. Um, under that circumstances, I'm going to ask for a trial setting and I can I will file a motion for speedy trial. I would ask that since he has been in so long that that uh, I can be ready uh, as soon as the court. I'm, I'm in trial next week, but as soon as the court and state could be ready, um, I would ask for the quickest trial date available uh, given hit the term that he has been waiting. All right. We'll ask the uh, jail to unmute Mr. Uh, Caton. And sir, is it Caton or Catton? One second. They're going to unmute. Which one is it? it? It's Catton. Okay. I'm sorry. Yeah, I, knew, okay. I knew a judge. I knew a judge Caton and I assumed that it might've been the same. Well, I hope we're not related. Well, she's already deceased, sir. <laughs> All right. Uh, all right. So it's my understanding then, uh, Mr. Catton, that you're asking that the matter be set for trial. And at this point, it would be both cases would be set for trial. Uh, and we will get, is that correct? You want a jury to make the decision in your case? Because you did, you're saying you didn't do it. So the, uh, the harassment of an officer is that's, that's being put back in there. Absolutely. The state's only was going to dismiss it if you accepted the plea agreement. And that's OK. Well, I don't I mean, want to be in your business. I just need to know if you did it or not. And you're saying you didn't. So now I want to set it for trial and I want to make sure you're picking what you want. And I think you want a jury. Is that right? Whatever. Well, it's your choice, sir. It's your case. Okay. I'll, All admit, right. I'll, I'll admit to trying to steal a PVC saw. Well, I don't need you to do anything for me. Let's go ahead and get it set for trial. You say you didn't do it. I want to know what you did to. to I'm saying I was homeless and I was looking for a place to sleep. I wasn't there to steal anything. I was there because I'm homeless and I was trying to find a new place to sleep. Okay. I wasn't trying to steal a PVC saw, but if they think I was trying to steal a PVC saw, then I'll admit to trying to steal a PVC saw. So we have an opening for trial setting. Have I already been in jail long enough for the for what they want for spitting on that cop? Sir, I'm not in the middle of plea negotiations. That's for y'all to handle. So let's look at, is August 12th a time frame the parties can be ready? 
Oh, God. Works for the state judge. I know we have a visiting judge on one case that week, but the state can be ready. I'm available that week, Your Honor. All right, let's go for August 12th. Now let's also set our pretrial. That'll be another time. That is enough. Your Honor, I may be I may need to file another motion. I, I would ask that we keep that court date, but I may ask that um that it, he be seen by a doctor be before then, out of an abundance of caution based on what I just saw as well um on on the call. Yeah, I I think you're going to have to have more information. The guy is obviously understand what's going on. This is not an incompetent person. This is somebody upset. He's been there a long time. I get it. I can't, though, take a plea of somebody who says they didn't do it. Yes, legally, and it's allowed. I haven't done it in 20 years while I'm on the bench. I'm not going to start now with Mr. Catton. So we need to go ahead and get him set for trial. I understand the frustration, um, but I'm not inclined, based on what I see, to appoint an attorney. Uh, a psychologist to say the guy's competent. He appears competent. He appears very upset. Now, I would encourage you to uh, assist in any advocacy he might need in the in the jail regarding uh, proper medications, uh, so that he has the medications he needs for any mental health issues he may have. And, and I did when I met with him uh, on May 18th. He indicated to me he was getting his medications in in the jail, but I will follow up to make sure that that's still happening. All right, and let's go ahead then and select our pretrial. If our trial date is August 12th, we want something about a month before that. Does July 24th work for the court? Well, that's a that's a Wednesday of a criminal trial week. That's not a good time for the court. Uh, if the state would look at maybe a Thursday morning or Friday afternoon, that is a little bit more reasonable because I would like to give you guys the time you need and it starts chafing us in our jury trials. I understand, Judge, the 25th maybe or 26th. We could even do July 12th, if that works for the defense. Uh, I'm available on the, uh, the the 25th or the 26th. Um, I do have, I, I, I already have depositions scheduled all day on the 12th, Your Honor. All right, we'll do it July 26, 2024 20, at 1.30 p.m. That'll give us the time we need. All right. And the uh, court had, had done some work on, on, on other motions and such. And I've I've withdrawn the uh, other work I did on the other case that is still a live uh, pleading at this time. OK, then we'll see everybody next on that uh, pretrial date. We do appreciate y'all's attention and, and uh, diligence on the matter.